So I'm Amy, if you don't know who I am. I didn't have migraine growing up. I feel like I got thrown in the deep end, so to speak, and I became chronic at the start of 2015, just a few months after I'd graduated from uni. and went into having daily head pain and at my worst, about 20 to 25 attack days a month, um, was completely debilitated, had to stop working, couldn't socialize, couldn't play sport, couldn't exercise, all of the things that were the norm to me suddenly got flipped upside down. And I spent a long, long time trying to get better, essentially. I spent a long time going through all the normal medical treatments, the system, different oral medications, injections, so many alternative treatments. And a few years in, I really kind of leaned in hard to researching and trying to find my own way. And that actually led me to the Migraine World Summit, which is where I would say I first learned about this type of work. Something called central sensitization, which many of you will have heard of, kept getting spoken about. And it's that which ultimately led me to Lynn because I'm hearing, oh, my brain has learned to stay in pain. Like, what does that possibly mean? But it made a lot of sense to me because I felt like I was just stuck in the cycle and couldn't get out. The last few years, it's something I would say I've been quietly working on on my own. I knew I was stuck in this fear pain cycle. I knew I needed help and I started the program. That's where I really progressed on actually implementing what I knew about pain, everything about central sensitization into my own life and finally making huge strides towards my own recovery. If I'm honest, I was really hopeful it would help, but I had no idea or like no expectation that realistically you would have got rid of my migraine attacks in the space of several months. So yeah, definitely was skeptical, but that's the truth. I, I would have been like, I'm really hopeful this is gonna help or like give me some tools and strategies, but not actually rewire my brain out of having migraine attacks. Like that's crazy. Yeah.